You okay, Sierra Rose? Oh, you're such a good girl. You're such a good girl. All right. Okay, we're halfway there. What the hell? What is this? Great. Okay, okay we're just gonna, gonna have to take it very slow. There's all this ice. No trees. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're on the lake. We're on the lake. Rex isn't gonna kill Stacy. If he does, it's on you. You know, why the hell did you have to go and tell him we were almost home free? Because he went looking through... He went looking through my backpack in a car and he found a copy of the will naming me as guardian. So? So he's not stupid, Kim. He figured it out and I explained the rest to him. I knew that will was a mistake. Okay, you know what? It, it doesn't even matter right now. It's over. It's done. The only thing that matters is that we have to find Stacy because she's out there somewhere carrying my kid. Would you get over yourself? Kim, it is my kid. You were out cold. She did all the work. Oh. You know what, she's the one who's, who's been carrying around the stupid kid for almost nine months, getting stretch marks and swollen ankles and who knows what else, not to mention labor, which if men had to give birth would be outlawed. So don't go telling me how you're the father, okay? You're just the donor, Sky. that's it. Still up for looking for Stacy? Oh, how about John and Natalie? Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. A pregnant woman in the woods takes precedence. Well, then I'm looking for them. I'll go with you. I'll find Stacy before either one of you two heroes. Jesse's gonna be all right. Yeah. I got there in time, and he didn't get a chance to, to go through with it. I, I'm sorry, I, I shouldn't have said all that. No, you had to. It was important that we know. It was just really hard to hear that. I know. With all his talk about being her loving father. He's not her father. He's the devil incarnate, and he's gonna pay for this. Well, listen. Thank God Brody got there in time, so nothing awful happened. Do I know you? Of course you know me. You don't have to be scared anymore, Jess. It's me. I've never seen you before in my life. I wish that were true. But there's more. Look, I'm gonna go up to the cabin and see if I can find Stacy. You okay with me for John? Yeah, I'll be fine. Okay, call me if you run into trouble. Okay? I will, I will. You too. Yes. Smoke? Had this idea. He wanted Jessica's loyalty. He wanted her to abandon her family, the two of you, Bree, and join his. But Jessica wasn't exactly compliant, so... So he shot her? No, no I'm sorry, this was before. Wait a minute, you mean Mitch didn't shoot her? No, actually, no, he didn't hit it. Uh, then who did, Brody? Dr. Evans. How's she? She's lost a lot of blood. There's internal bleeding. We're getting her up for surgery. Okay, but you can fix her, right? I mean, she, she's not gonna... She's gonna be all right. Ma'am, I'm warning you for the last time. Ma'am, you can't help your family if you're in jail. Disappoint me. I thought she would do anything to protect your girls. I have. Oh, then you're slipping. Otherwise, you would have shot me when you had the chance. Now, they're on their own. So vulnerable. You bastard! <laughs> Got this, ma'am. He can't hurt anyone anymore. Oh, you don't believe him, though, do you? You know me too well, Dorian. You know what I'm capable of. Get him out of here. Ah. In fact, uh, one of your girls is already doomed. The wheels are in motion and there is nothing you can do to stop it. Rex is having a baby with Gigi's sister. How did that happen? The usual. 
usual way. I'll save the details for another time. Not that I'm in any place to judge, having had a baby with Kevin's son. I think Duke would have been happy with the way things turned out. I wouldn't give up my Zane for anything. Mm. Although I did make a pretty big mess of things for a while. You aren't the only one. I brought Brody Lovett, ex-Navy SEAL, to town to break up Rex and Gigi. Totally backfired. He turned out to be a really decent guy, though. He's with Jessica, right? Yeah, last I heard. Oh, I miss her. I hope she's doing okay. Now with Mitch back in Lambeau. 